This is going to be a mini general collective tarot reading. If it's meant for you, it's meant for you. The unknown card. How many of you right now are sort of crying or upset because you don't know what's happening? The unknown is scary. Potential or a challenge, the moon. We just had a full moon in Capricorn. Purging, surrendering, bringing things to light, things that we can't sweep under the rug anymore. Now, what should you focus on today? Ten of Cups and the Page of Pentacles. So, studying and learning, growing, moving towards your happiness here. It's one thing to ask for happiness, another thing to allow it. Now, your recent past, we have here the Ace of Swords, truth and clarity. There might have been something that came to light where you've got to address it. You've got to acknowledge it, make that change. Now, the strength position is the Hermit and the Ten of Wands. Some of you may be isolating yourself because you're mentally, physically, spiritually, and emotionally exhausted, or you could be avoiding making any moves because you're just too tired. Totally understand. Take the rest you need, but you got to make a move at some point. Now, the near future is the Knight of Wands. This is passion in the pants. This is this idea that says, I'm motivated, but that motivation needs to sustain itself because that energy can ride in quickly and leave just as fast. We don't want any hot and cold energy. Now, the suggested approach is the Empress birthing a whole new cycle. What do you have to lose here? That's all about self-worth, self-value, and self-respect. Now, what do we need to know? We have the Eight of Cups walking away from things that no longer serve us. The hope and our fear, it's the star. We hope for healing, but sometimes we fear it too because it means what's next. It's like that energy that says, what am I going to worry about when I have nothing to worry about? And the probable outcome, the Ace of Cups. I'm confident that you're going to be filling your own cup. Let me know if this resonates.